वेलकम बैक सो वॉट आर आउटकम्स आउटकम्स आर द गोल्स दैट वी वॉन्ट टू अचीव वी आर नाउ इन द प्रजेंट एंड वी वॉन्ट थिंग्स इन आर फ्यूचर इट मे बी इन द नियर फ्यूचर लेटर टूडे और टुमारो सो दिस इज समथिंग दैट वी डिजायर टू अचीव ना वन मस्ट ऑलवेज रिमेंबर दैट दीज आउटकम्स शुड बी पॉजिटिव like when we say i want to be rich i want to be healthy these are positive outcomes you want something and the mind responds to it but if you say i want to lose weight well the mind doesn't want to lose anything after all it has taken some time and effort to gain something why would it want to lose it and that is why these things these outcomes are not achievable i want to leave smoking i want to give up smoking sorry the mind will say i have gained something why will i give up so this is a contradiction um basically you can say that this is a conflict of interest so rather than that you can say i want to be a public speaker i want to be slim here you also have to understand that you have to be specific you can't say i want to meet someone that is very vague someone means who someone means what so you have to be specific when you say i want to be slim then you have to be specific about what is the concept of slim how will the mind perceive something to be slim so there has to be the weight so achieving a certain weight is a positive outcome with specific then comes evidence so evidence means how will you know how will you know that you have achieved something lot of people achieves things but they have no idea why because uh, there is no evidence in their mind that they have achieved something so the evidence should be very clear that you have reached there you have an outcome that you want to achieve and how will you know that you have achieved that outcome so maybe you want to go some some place how will you know you have reached there if you are going by train then you will see the station it will be written the name of the station will be written so then you will know that you have reached there similarly people become successful but still live in depression why because they did not have did, did not create any evidence of that achievement so they cannot quantify it they don't know they are successful yes people are saying hey you are successful but they don't feel it so this is very important then come resources the resources that will be required do you have all the resources money equipment knowledge your own communication skill your energy level so these should be there if there is a lack of resources then you have to get the resources it's as simple as that then another thing that is important is the outcome should not disturb balance it should not be something that is a uh, nonsensical i want to be a great alcoholic i want to be a great smoker smokers are not great alcoholics are not great this statement itself is a nonsense it does not make any sense it is out of balance so these are not outcomes these are nonsensical statements that only waste time 
the another aspect is identity what you are creating do you identify with it if you don't relate with it then you don't get the outcome and you can see this happening in relationships you get into a relationship each person has a different perception of the future and then they get married and then everything becomes a mess and then they get divorced why because the perception is different they don't relate to what they are doing and what happens is if you relate to it very strongly then you are more committed to it so some people are very committed to their relationships their marriage while others are not because they don't relate to it so that is how you get commitment so identity is very important then there is control now you have lot of resources but those resources are not yours you have no control over them then how will you achieve the outcome because you don't have the resources or you don't have the accessibility to those resources they are accessible sometimes or they are accessible Uh, depending on some other people then how will you have any control so again that that is uh, more of an obstacle in your path so it should not be dependent on others other people will do this somebody will do that and then i will become successful in life now how do you know they will do that or this if you want to achieve something then you have to assume control and you have to assume responsibility also if you don't do that what will happen every time you fail or you lose an opportunity you will make excuses you will blame others because you don't have any control so these are the things that you need if you want to be have a successful outcome so this is what you do in nlp